Hi, my name is Corbin, and I'm going to give you a quick tour of my electric car, which I call the Plug Bug. It's a 1969 Volkswagen Beetle. I restored it, painted it, two-tone, metallic red, metallic silver. Suspension's lowered two inches, and it's brought in with a shortened beam, adjustable, it's adjusted as high as it'll go. And over here, Take a look at the inside. The interior. Over here on the left, we have a net gain interface module hidden behind. Here is half the battery pack. The other half's in the front trunk. They are 3.2 volt Thunder Sky lithium iron phosphate batteries, 200 amp hours each, 48 of them, five or horizontal. They're encompassed in one eighth an inch sheet aluminum in plates. The negative most terminal is here, positive most terminal is here, and right off of it is a fuse, 500 amp. The lithium BMS, the brain for it is back here, the controller. Little gray wires run to each bank. There are four banks of cells, one bank here, two banks here of 14 each, one bank there of five, and the front is uh, a bank in itself. There is a big disconnect for the main power, another little disconnect for the charger cord which runs to the front. Up in front, second battery half pack. Currently not connected right now. I have a secondary fuse which just protects it in case the two wires short out. It will not draw current from the front. I have solid copper bus bars that I made in my milling machine. Manzanilla Micro PFC 30. Little fuse block where I'm actually working on getting it for the charging plug. Charging plug is right inside of the gas tank. And the plug, you just flip the gas tank and you have the charging plug. It's a uh, NEMA L630 if I recall right. We'll see if it can really support 30 amps. Uh, apparently it can't support 30 amps continuous. Now and to the back of the bug. A little low light, but we have the net gain warp 9. Be back in a second. Okay, now we have some light back here. So what do we have? We've got the Netgain Warp 9. It's the main 9-inch uh, DC motor. We have the Netgain Controls controller, uh, 1,000 amps. And this is a little can UV heater. It has a ceramic heater core and a blower. It blows into the original ducting of the bug, only on one side currently. So far it gets pretty warm. IOTA. DLS 55 DC to DC converter converts the high voltage to 12 volt DC. This here is a Curtis Albright um, <coughs> uh, thing with bobber <laughs> to contactor to give you power. So when you turn on the key, negative side is completed from the negative side of the pack to the positive negative uh, uh, for the controller. We have a couple little fuse distribution panels. Everything is fused quite safely. Hidden down here in the corner is a uh, um, a little inertia switch so if you hit something really fast it will actually cut off key on power to everything here and turn down the controller. Uh, there's another fuse up here it's a 30 amp high voltage fuse for the CAN EV or sorry for the DC DC converter there's another one in line for the CAN EV heater there is the positive conductor on the other side here this contactor is controlled by the controller. When you flip on the key, turn on the ignition for a brief moment, it closes this contactor and then you're ready to go. Right to the side of it is another baby contactor, which is controlled by the fan switch. The fan switch has three wires for three different speeds running from the front to switch the speed. The three wires run into a diode so it won't reverse the leak some current out. And one single wire goes over to the little contactor to flip on and off when any of the fan speeds is on. Water reservoir, the 
controller is water cooled and the wire reservoir has a little pump underneath it in the back and right here is some fans, little DC 12 volt fans and a radio underneath uh, I ran up my hill without the radiator on or without the fans on it seemed fine outside the controller there's throttle line, sorry, throttle line, uh, CAN bus line, which is just a regular Ethernet port that goes to the interface module. And general overview of the bug. Thanks.